Hey guys, it's Dresden, and today is going to be a short little video. I wanted to see what would happen if you take the um, stuff out of a vacuum cleaner, like you just swept the floor, and you have all the dust and all that in the vacuum cleaner. I wanted to see what would happen if you took all that and lit it on fire, you tried to light it on fire. So I have the fire pit out here. Just had a, just finished my cardboard video that'll be uploaded soon. And uh, yeah, what we're gonna do also, we just got our trees trimmed. I don't know if you realize that, it's a lot more open now. Like a lot more open, like he trimmed down that. And oh, it's so bright, that. And a lot of other stuff, he trimmed down this huge one here. Also, there's no trampoline here, because the trampoline is there. So what we're doing is, we're taking this trampoline, moving it here, taking this swing set, getting rid of it, no more swing set, and then we're gonna build an in-ground fire pit here, or something like that. No, we're not. We're either building it here, or there. Because what we're doing here, we figured that, just like our neighbor's fire pit, where they burn their Christmas trees and all that craziness, what we're gonna do, we're gonna cut out circle here, put the fire pit right here, about at this corner of the deck, so that you can walk in, do that, and then we have space for all the games, like you can play maybe can jam there, uh, cornhole here, and frisbee, whatever. You have the fire pit here, having the fire, so if you're cold or whatever, you just come over here. There's no way to drop anything in there unless you really suck at frisbee, or feel like dropping your cam jam thing in there, or your, you know, you're playing cornhole and you're like, Dah! even though the board's like that ball there and you're, you're like throwing it over there, other way, throwing it over there. I don't know why you do that. <laughs> oh, Drago is so funny. So yeah, we are going to try this and it is very windy out. But we are going to try it anyway. Ow. But we're gonna try it anyway. So yeah, I'm wearing my dad's nice, huge, like, size 11 shoes right now. I wear size 8, so this is not correct. So the materials you need for this are your vacuum cleaner and a floor. That should be clean because you just swept it. And a lighter. So you take everything that you normally find in your vacuum cleaner and you just, you just snap off the sides and you take it outside. So then, once you have it outside... Mary me now, I'm just locked the door. Struggle, come on! So, once you have... Oh, hold on, no brand names. So once you have your, uh, eh, your vacuum cleaner, nozzle thingy, you're gonna wanna put it here. Again, these are all things you normally find in it. And you want to grab your lighter because I may or may not have accidentally left that inside. Right, Drago? Yeah. Okay, so what you're going to want to do is take your lighter and set it down. Boom. Now, you take your tissues that you swept up and totally didn't just shove in there. And you want to lay them out in a nice pattern on your fire pit. Ugh. That's hot. Beautiful. You're going to save this one. You're going to roll that up. Then you're gonna take everything else that you swallowed, your envelope and your uh, tickets included, everything you find in your house that you could sweep up, and you dump it on the fire. Ah, oh, hold on a sec. Yeah, forgot how this thing works. Okay, and you dump it over the fire, like this. Ah. Oh. Try not to miss, like I did. Ah. Get out of there! Okay. And then you just go, whoop, and boom. Now your vacuum's fine. So now what you're gonna wanna do is take your lighter, and you're going to, oh, steamy. It's already on fire. You're gonna grab your stuff, put it on there. Then what you're going to want to do is take this, roll it up in a line like this, perfect, 
you're gonna wanna light the end of it on fire. And then, voila. Now let's see if it actually catches on fire or not. <laughs> oh my gosh. I feel like it might actually be catching on fire. Sort of, not really though. The hair is on fire. The hair is no longer on fire. Goes away. Jago, I'm burning your fur. He's like, I know. It smells bad. Oh, so, I guess that answers your guys' question that none of you had. <coughs> Now I'm gonna put all this crap on it. You're gonna watch you're gonna watch all this crap burn now. Including this piece of paper that I have for some reason. Cool. Alright, so that answers all one of your burning questions. What happens if you burn what is inside of your vacuum cleaner? Nothing! Well it catches on fire, I guess. I mean <laughs> could have figured that one out by the fact that you, you know, decided to sweep up an envelope and some tickets from, from a skating rink, an unnamed skating rink that I will not name, because I said I won't name it. I hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, smash that like button and hit the red subscribe button and that bell icon to get notified when we upload, because we upload a lot. Uh, every weekend because school started a while ago. It's now November. Started in kind of August. Uh, until next time, this has been Dresden. He should stop playing with the lighter. It's out of lighter fluid almost. And goodbye. I mean, goodbye.